If you're new to live streaming and wondering how to make your stream look super cool to stand out from the crowd, this video is for you. I'm Nona Blackman for Envato Tuts Plus, and in this video, I'll show you how to use a fabulous tool from Placeit. It will help you create terrific stream overlays quickly and easily. Go to placeit.net and choose Game In from the menu, then select OBS Stream Overlays. As you can see, there are tons of gorgeous templates to choose from. Take a look, and when you find one that you like, just click on it. This will open the OBS Overlay Maker, where you'll find a number of tools that you can use to customize your template. Step number two, select your background. The template comes with a number of wonderful images that you can use. Alternatively, you can enter your own search term right here. Here you'll see a number of images which relate to your search term, Galaxy in this case. Another option that you have is to upload an image from your computer by clicking Custom Image. Once the image is uploaded, we can resize it and move it around to fit the screen. You can also opt for a solid colored background. Ooh, that's a little hot. I actually like one of the images that came with the template, so I'm going to use that. Now on to step three, choose your color scheme. For this, you need to go to the column on the left and just scroll down and open the color picker. I am going to go for a slightly deeper pink. That'll work. Now you're going to change the color of these social media icons. To do that, go to icons color in the column on the right. Um, I think I'll go for blue, maybe a deeper, brighter blue. And now we're going to change the live cam frame color. I think I'll use the same color that I used with the icons. Now for step four, we're going to add some text. I'm going to go back to the column on the left and start at the top. Add the name. Here you can also change the font. There are several options. I think maybe I will go for graduate. Yes, I like that. And after you've changed your font, you can change the color of your font. Let's try deeper pink. No, don't think that will work. I think I'll stick with white. You can change any of the text here to suit your own needs. I'll add Dance and Diva for the rest of the text. You can change the placement of the elements in your template. For instance, if you wanted to move the social media icons to space them out a bit more, you can do that. You can also move the top text if you want. You can resize the live cam frame. You can move it around to another location in your frame. And, um, you know, you can just experiment and see what you like. And don't worry if you end up hating everything you've done. Just click this reset layout button and it will take you back to the default. When you're happy with your design, you move to the fifth and final step, which is to download your design. You can download it for a small fee by hitting this button right here. And that's it. That's how you use an OBS overlay maker in five simple steps. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, go ahead and tell the world by giving it a thumbs up. And if you want to see other terrific videos from Envato Tuts Plus, subscribe today. I'm Nona Blackman, and I'll see you next time.